welcome to another video at teach learn create with candace and because you ladies have bought up all of the my favorite things lip balm holders i had to learn how to make my own so in this video i'm going to share how i made my lip um my own money holder domes So for this um, DIY um, dome, I use the Fellows in, uh, laminated paper, and this is the three milliliters versus using the um, the five. I think that's how I, I, you say it, but it's the lesser of between the three and the five. And I use this because I found that this had the best. Um, the the best thickness for creating the domes i tried to do this with the window sheets but it was just too difficult to um trying to do my score lines and i think it was just because the window sheets that i have was too thick so here i am going to cut down uh my window sheets i mean my lam my laminate I'm cutting that down to four by two and this is so I can have a three by one dome so I did cut out two because I um, I'm making a couple of these for my templates and then I'm going to use my laminate again and I'm just going to reinsert my um piece of laminate here just because when you do it the first time it's going to wrinkle up on you so just to help straighten it out a bit i run it back through and then i'm using my scoreboard and on all four sides you're going to want to score at a half inch and um a quarter of an inch and that's going to help get, give you the height that you need for your dome. Now, originally when I d came up with the template for the domes, I thought I was, um, I needed it to be, um, bigger, but then I just realized that the way you flatten out the money will help, um, help you in the sizing of the domes that you need. So take into account if you wanted to recreate this for actual lip balms, just take the measurements of your lip balm and that's going to help you get the height of the dome that you're going to need. So here I'm just continuing doing the scoring on all four sides. And again, that was at a half an inch and at a quarter of an inch. And I'm going to fold in this um the half inch score nines on all four sides and i'm going to use my bone folder to give it a really good press so you're really going to want something to um to do that with okay so you can start seeing the thing shaping and then the corners i am i am going to cut out all four corners because I don't need I don't need those. And I keep bending just to make sure I'm cutting where I want to cut. And then I'm going to take the um, quarter inch score lines and i'm going to do a valley fold so you're going to have like a mountain and a valley fold because the way that i do my domes is i'd like the domes to be on the inside i don't want the outside piece showing so the way like the lip balm um, domes are you just stick it on the outside and for me, I don't particularly care for that. I like it on the inside to cover up the adhesive. So I'm doing a valley fold and I'm here and I'm just taking one of my um, templates to make sure that I can get it in and it does fit. 
and then I'm going to take some double-sided adhesive and this double-sided adhesive is about a quarter of an inch and I'm going to put this on all four sides And then I'm going to remove one of the strips and I'm just reinforcing my folds to make sure I have a really good fold. So I'm just sticking it through. And the reason why I did it this way is because if you're doing this for clients or anything like that, you could then add adhesive on the inside um, using some double-sided adhesive for when they're ready to put the money in and so now I'm just inserting that and see if you look see now that's going to be your dome so here's where I was talking about where you could then add adhesive um, double-sided adhesive to the inside um, and I will leave it j with the um, with the paper on there especially if you're making it for a client so that way, once they put their money inside, they can remove the adhesive and just it, um, finish um, adhering that. And that is it. That is how you make um, you make your own money holder domes. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. I'm, I'm almost at a thousand subscribers. So I would love for you to subscribe to my channel to see more videos.